Good morning, YouTube world. It is April 9th <coughs> at 7.24 a.m. and we are on our way to IMAX. Yay! Exciting. It is 37 degrees. Exciting. It's not that bad out. We're running late because <laughs> it takes us forever to get ready. But I'm excited. Can't wait to spend money. My hair is a mess as usual, but I'm excited. It's so nice out. There's like no one out here. It's kind of weird on our campus. We're getting in the car, taking the Long Island Railroad into Penn Station, and then the E train to Pier 94. <laughs> Okay, so it is 1224. We've been here for how long now? Two and a half hours. We've been here for two and a half hours. And I've spent, I want to say close to $300. The deals are pretty good. Um, I don't know, it's just like exciting to see all the stuff and like figure out what you want. We're waiting online right now for Juvia's Ju plate. It's, it's like a palette. I'm probably not going to get anything, but Amy wants something right now. We're standing in front of Morphe. Um, not sure what their deals are, but everything's pretty much 20 to like 40% off. Also, MAC, I'm in love with them. Their stuff was pretty much gone, so they gave us a, a voucher to go to Times Square to get stuff that we weren't able to get there. So that's really cool. Um, I've gotten a lot of stuff. I'm excited. It's fun. I know I don't sound like it, but I'm really tired. I got like three hours of sleep. Um, and we've been standing all day so my feet kind of hurt but yeah I wish I could vlog more it's just really difficult and it's like initially when we got here it wasn't that crowded but now it's getting really crowded and the lines are super long so I'll probably film a line but honestly it's not as bad as I thought it was going to be also check out my hand oh my gosh I'm in love with glitter I bought three glitters for $25 I don't even know what the brand is but like this is me trying to take it off. Like my, It's gonna be crazy when I wear it. Hello YouTube world, welcome back to my channel. Um, today I come to you with exciting news and an exciting new video. Um, so this weekend I went to IMAX New York 2017. I actually went today, it is April 9th. It is currently like 10, 10 and I am exhausted from today. But I had a lot of fun, I got a lot of things, and I'm excited to show you guys what I got. So, IMATS 2017, uh, this is the first year that I've ever been to IMATS, and me and my roommate went together, and I was really excited. I am still really excited about it, I can't believe it happened, like, it was so much fun. The event started at 10, and we got there at around 9.30. We wanted to be there at 9, but we're always running late, so, you know. We got there at a good time, because a lot of people hadn't showed up yet. So we were kind of towards the front line and the line was really long, but um, we got in pretty early. So this is the bag of goodies I got from IMAX. It's really funny because I was looking at videos and pictures and like people had posted pictures of stuff they got and I was expecting like mm, a whole bunch of bags. Um, but the thing is they give you that bag when you first go in and you can kind of just throw all your stuff in there instead of carrying like 15 bags around, which makes sense because, you know, who wants to do that? Who wants to like carry a bajillion bags around? So one bag was great. So I guess let's get started on the first place we went to. I'll probably try to do these in order, but we'll see. The first place we went to was Anastasia. Um, initially, I kind of just wanted some brow stuff because they're pretty good with brow stuff, so that's what I got. It came in this package like this. And what I got was I got um, the Brow Wiz pencil in Ebony. Uh, so the next thing I got was the pomade. 
and this one is in dark brown so I have been using elves pomade recently and I think it's a little bit too dark for me so I got this one and I was looking at this on the train or like yeah I think it was on the train and I looked at it and I'm like I don't know this seems kind of light for me even though this is dark brown I mean I'll definitely try it out um, and I'll see what happens but um I paid 31 for both of these so I think it was a pretty good deal I'm happy with pretty much all my purchases I made so yeah that was the first purchase I made then the next place we went to was Nigel's I got from Nigel's was the Stila Magnificent Metals Glitter and Glow and this is an eyeshadow and it comes in this packaging and I got it in bronze belt I have oh, what's the other one smoldering something I'll put it on the, the screen here, but um, I got that one already and I'm wearing it right now. And I wanted so many more. I want the black one, I want the um, rose gold one, but they only had four. So I just got the bronze bell and it's really pretty. I'll swatch it for you guys. If I can open it. The packaging, it's so pretty. Like I literally want all of them. So this retails for 25 on the website and on... and. Yeah, on the website and at Sephora, um, and I got it for $14.50, so really good deal, I think. Oh my gosh. So pretty. Interesting, this one is kind of like, hmm, liquidy, but oh my gosh. It's not doing it any justice, it's so pretty. Yeah, so really, really pretty. Well, I went to them first. I don't know how to pronounce them. I never really heard of them before either, but I got the, I'm obsessed with blending brushes, just so you know, and foundation brushes. So I got the Eyes 776 blending brush. Oh my gosh. And that is what it looks like. I don't know if you guys can see that, but it's like a fluffy blending brush. And then I got the I-767, and it's a round dome blender, and it's pink. It has like a pink handle, so it looks like that. And then from the last one I got from there was the Face 957 Precision Kabuki. Oh my gosh, I love Kabuki brushes. So this is what it looks like. This one's pink, too. It's like a kabuki brush. I don't know if you can see it. It just has a pink handle. So this one was eleven dollars. The kabuki brush, the I seven six seven round dome blender was six dollars, and the seven seven six blending was six dollars. Next, we went to Per. I feel like I'm literally butchering all these names. I'm so sorry, but pure, pure. We went here. And I was trying to get the 4-in-1 uh, foundation, but apparently that is no longer being made. Um, so instead, I got a highlighting palette. This one is the Sun Kiss Glow Strobing Highlight Palette. And this also apparently is not being sold anymore in stores. I'm just like, what is going on? So yeah, it's really pretty. I got this one. What it looks like. Oh, this is actually so pretty. I might look at, uh, at more of their stuff actually because like it's so pretty looking. Oh my gosh. And this is what it looks like. This is cream to um cream to powder. I almost forgot I bought this. It's like washing me out so much. There we go. That's what it looks like. I don't know. It doesn't do it justice. It's very pretty in person. I really like the middle one. I'm literally probably going to wear all of this stuff tomorrow and test it out. There we go. Pretty, pretty. Yeah, I really wanted it. And I was like, oh, maybe I'll come back. But I was like, you know what? Let me just do it. Because she said they, there's only 10 left. And I don't know. I was just like... Pay $65 to come and buy stuff, so might as well just come and buy stuff. 
Then we went to Coco. This one is 501. Oh my gosh. Wow, you really can't see me. These are the 501s. I think they're pretty. These are the these are the 107s. These are nice. Like I really, really like these. I was gonna actually get two, like three of these because the deal was three for nine. Yeah, this is the 105. So I got the 501, 107, 105, and all three of these came out to nine dollars. Three for nine. And normally they're seven dollars each. And then I got this set that was eight dollars. Ooh, excuse me. This is what it looks like. This one is a 206. This one is the 104. And this one is a 106. They're pretty, right? They're cute. Okay, guys. Literally everything has to go wrong whenever I film. If anything could possibly go wrong, it always happens. Like, oh my. Let's get back into finishing this boatload of crap I got. Last thing I said was that I went to Coco for eyelashes and I showed you the eyelashes that I got. But the I was really excited about to get from them was this lipstick container. It holds 36 lipsticks and it cost me 12 bucks. I really wish I had more of these things like at IMAX, honestly, because I need this. The next place we went to was where I got all of my brushes. It's Revolution BX20 from Royal Langnickel Beauty Collection. This is what it looks like. Oh, I guess they're all from the same thing, let's see. Yeah, Royal and Langnickel. So then I got the Moda MO2 brush. And it's a multi-purpose powder brush, so I got this so that I could use it for um, blush. So this is what it looks like. Ooh, ah. I even, oh yeah, they were pretty soft when I felt them. Very pretty. I'm so excited to use these. Oh my gosh, okay. I got a eyebrow brush. It's brow. M22 from Royal and Lang Nickel it has the same kind of like pattern on the bottom. Ooh, ah, oh my gosh, wait, do I have like glitter on my face? Literally glitter all over my body, and I'll tell you about that soon. And this is the concealer M08. And it, again, the same kind of like detail, and it's like this. And I bought this to use to like touch up underneath my eyebrows. So, so pretty, guys. Oh, and I got this um, crease brush. It's the BMD 430 brush. This is what it looks like. Wow, like I'm about to shop at this place because these brushes feel so nice. This part is like soft. Like, soft, what is it? It's just soft, it's really soft. I don't know what this material is, but oh, so pretty. I'm so excited. Oh my gosh, my roommate's FaceTiming me. What, I'm filming. How are you filming? Sorry, so the next brush I got from them is the, is the Crease BOM14 brush, again. Crease brushes, kabuki brushes, I love it. Oh, wow. And it has a pointy end. Oh, guys, I'm in love with them now. Like, I literally want to go buy all of their brushes. This one's from, this one's Omnia. It's Royal and Lang Nickel Omnia BOM14 Crease. Oh, my freaking gosh. These are so pretty. Like, when I was getting them, I didn't even realize how nice these were. All right, the next one, again, another crease brush. Um, this one is the, the BMD 445 brush. The last one I got was 
the Omnia BOM37 and this was for highlighting. I should have got one for under eye, but I wasn't thinking. I'm probably just gonna go buy one online now because wow, these brushes feel amazing. This is it. It's pretty. So I got those brushes and they all came out to $52. The next place we went, I want to say, was MBA Cosmetics. MBA Cosmetics. The perfect fit for your beauty tricks. That's what it does. And I don't know if I've ever heard of it, but like, oh my gosh. I'm going to show you right now what I got, but like, literally glitter everywhere. I'm, I'm just going to show you guys what they look like because I will literally have glitter, more glitter all over my body. So the reason I have glitter all over me is because I got these. They're the Chroma Lights Foil FX Glitter. This one's Kiss by Cupid. And I don't know if you can see it. It's more brown sparkles. Brown sparkles. And like I always go towards like more neutral colors. So I don't want anything too crazy on my eye. But then my roommate convinced me to try something different. So then I got Trixie. And this one's more like lavendery sparkles. Oh my gosh, guys. I'll show you the video because like whew, these colors are amazing. I'm really excited about I don't know where I'm gonna be wearing this but like oh, it was so pretty so this one is called candy spark no candy sprinkles and it's like a fun fetty kind of like oh my gosh guys so pretty yeah so I got three of those these were three for um these were three for 25 we went to dose of color but then I wanted to go to Inglot. Oh no, I skipped one. So before we went there, we went to Tweezer Man. And I, these are like the best tweezers on the market, I'm pretty sure. But like, they're expensive. And like I said, most of the companies are huge. Like, their discounts are only $3 off. And like, I guess, you know, a discount to discount. But I'm just like, $27 for a tweezer? what so anyways one is the one that i got it's like the classic tweezer um i just wanted one another tweezer because like i wanted one that was super sharp and i know these are super sharp so i got this one and this came out too with tax 22 dollars 23 then when my roommate was at dose of color i went to inglot and i got a lipstick from inglot and I was trying to find some more stuff to buy there, but I really couldn't. But this lipstick I'm so excited for is so pretty. Looks like this. Ombie, very Molly. Do I have something like this? I don't think so. I'm gonna swatch. Oh, I kind of do. I don't know, but it's pretty. I liked it. I think it's pretty. Very pretty, very nice. Very excited about that. Oh, this is the... HD lip tint matte and it is in the number 33 when it dries I'll show it to you again because it changes color a little bit so after that I went to NYX I wanted to get foundation at the point because I hadn't gotten foundation so total control drop foundation was really good so we went and got that I went and got um shade matched which was really good because there were so many options i was like wait a second there's a lot of options here and i was like oh this looks this one's good oh wait a second maybe this one oh wait a second maybe this one but i was able to get matched and i am in the number 21 or coco but i needed a new tr makeup train case caboodle thing because my broke i got this one from nyx was 30 dollars initially 50 and this is what it looks like. Oh, oh my gosh. So it has like two of these on each side and this is the, the depth of it. So like right here, my old one it broke, like literally these two sides broke. And I'm hoping that doesn't happen with this one. It's leather, it smells like leather. Okay, so after NYX, we were trying to leave but then I went to Jouer and I was just trying to like see what's there. Like I know Jackie Aina, she like 
is the queen of Jouet and like promotes them. So I was like, oh, you know, let me see what's out there. Let's see what's here. And I don't know. <laughs> oh my gosh, guys, I'm so tired. I'm like a mess. But I was just like, oh, let me test these out. So I was testing them out, but girl, girl, I got the long wear lip cream. Okay, you can't see that. Got the long wear lip cream. This is what it looks like. Oh, I can't even hold it this right now. What sold me on this color was the person that was working, the makeup artist or like worker who was working behind the counter. She's like, oh, I think this will look pretty on you. So I was like, oh, let me try it. But I had been swatching other ones prior. And girl, this stuff smells amazing. Amazing. Oh my gosh, it smells so freaking good. It smells like pure sugar. Like it smells like frosting, frosting on cake. And I love frosting. Like I don't like cake and I only eat the frosting. And that's why I bought this. That's like, literally why I bought this. I was like, I cannot leave without smelling this again. Like, I'm not even kidding. Like I was like, okay, yeah, whatever. This was $15 from 18 obviously not that much of a difference but you know you, you have to sh pay for shipping when you buy them online love the packaging super cute oh my gosh guys i'm in love literally why i bought it because it smells so good and this is what it looks like super pretty and then you can see also this one this is the nyx that was there before and it's much lighter now not lighter but like more grayish than it was before when it was drying but this is the one from Jouer. The last place we went to was Makeup Forever. And we went there because of the foundations. And that was the last place we went to for makeup for, um, the last place we went to for eye mats. So we had to buy five things and we would get them 50% off. So I got two things, I remember we got three. And then I just gave her money, she put it on her card. So I got two things, 50% off. Ended up spending $36 for these two things. $36, guys. So, Makeup Forever Ultra HD Stick Foundation, and this one is in Y505. I'll open it. It looks like this. I've never tried Makeup Forever Foundation before, but I'm excited to try it. Got this one, and this is what it looks like in the packaging. And it is the... is it Y49? I want to say yes. This is the Y49. This is my for under eye concealer. Y49. It's a little bit lighter than my like skin tone. Yeah. So that's the last thing I got. But I also want to say I skipped Mac. I went to Mac and I got some stuff from there. But I will just clump everything together because. <laughs> oh my gosh. Let me explain. <laughs> We went to MAC, but they sold out of everything so fast, like super, super fast. And when I got there, so what they did was, because excellent customer service, MAC, I see you, I see you. They gave us a voucher to use in the MAC Times Square location up until midnight when they closed. So they gave us a voucher and they were like, oh, they have all that stuff there. Just go there and, um, before, you know, it expires. And I was like... Hey, I see you. Was this eyeshadow in Sketch? So then I also just got another. Um, I got a eyebrow pencil and spiked, and I've had this before and I've used it. And I really, really like it. I was very happy with that. But I was like, I want more stuff. So they gave us the voucher. We took our butts down to Mac Times Square, Mac, and uh, we got some more crap. So what I ended up getting was obviously Fix Plus. I actually, not even gonna lie, I never used this. And I was like, I think I need to try this out. Like everyone is raving about it all the time. Then I got, cause I'm crazy. Oh wait. Cause I'm crazy. <laughs> I got Sketch in blush form. Hey. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited guys. Also hysterical because I'm tired AF. So got sketch and blush as well as eyeshadow. And then I saw this at IMAX and I'm like, oh, like, I don't know. I'm into like dark colors. So this is film 
Nior. Can you tell the difference between these two? Can you even tell? Okay, like, here's a little bit more purple. This is more brown. Let's open these up. Be surprised together, because this is huge. Look at this. This is the Pro Palette Large Duo. Two faces. Wait. This is like plastic, and then... I'm like nervous. Literally only two blushes in here, and it's so big. Okay, so this is the container. This is the container that I put it in. It has like a little screen here. So you lift up the screen, you can put it in there. That's cool. Okay, so confused. So now I have this. And this. And obviously like, their blush doesn't fit into this. Um, Wow, guys, super confused. I was so confused. I mean, I guess I'm happy about this, and now I have to go back to MAC to buy eyeshadow. The last thing that I got for myself was a lipstick. It is a lipstick. And this is definitely something that I don't normally do. Are you ready? Are you guys ready? oh my gosh like honestly blue lipstick is so in and it has been in for a while i know my friend like for a long time it's like purpley blue too oh it's so pretty i'll swatch it and then i'll also put it on my lips because i want to see what it looks like on my lips i didn't test it out in the store i just tested it out on my hand that's what it looks like guys come on <laughs> so pretty oh my gosh <laughs> so pretty i actually really like it you guys can see the purple right it's so pretty uh, so pretty what am i gonna wear with this i'm wearing this tomorrow what am i gonna wear with this it's so pretty let's see if people say some some stuff to me about it they would be like what are you wearing and i'm like <laughs> it's called oh yeah let me tell you what i am wearing it, it's matte royal a26 well like it's called royal like that's the name like it tries new things you know like that's really what like <laughs> makeup and life is about trying new things getting out of your comfort zone this is so pretty i'm so excited <laughs> so excited so yeah so this cost me 11.90 oh my gosh no it did it cost me 5.10 but I need to definitely... Do you see how it changes color? Oh my gosh, I love it. It's the end of my haul. I got a lot of stuff. This video is really long. I apologize in advance. I apologize. Um, eye mask was amazing. I recommend you going if you love makeup. Bring a friend. It was super fun. Be prepared to walk and stand for a long time and your feet hurt a little bit and wait in lines but you will get things you like and it may not be everything but it's gonna be stuff that you're happy with and oh my gosh I'm just so excited and happy with like everything this whole day everything went perfectly and I don't know just so excited so I'm so happy and thankful that I was able to go I hope in the future you guys are able to go i know i'm pretty sure that they have like i'm at again in december or in next year i probably won't be going next year because i don't know it was expensive i spent a lot of money wow i'm super happy um i don't know if i'm gonna go next year depending on like who's gonna be there and what products are coming out um it was just really expensive the ticket was 65 itself uh, transportation food and then I spent like 400 plus dollars but I was very happy with it um, and I hope you guys can go if you went comment down below like share your video as well share what you bought and blah 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 <laughs> I'm very interested to see what you guys got and yeah thanks for watching comment like share and I'll see you in my next video bye guys